So why the heck does your dog convulse and reverse sneeze all the time? Hi guys, I'm Dr. Lindsay Butzer, a small animal veterinarian, and I first want to thank this video's sponsor, the NASC. You could find their yellow quality seal on thousands of pet supplements for dogs, cats, and horses. I'm gonna put a link to their website in my description below, and you guys can check out the thousands of supplements that have their yellow quality seal. This is what a reverse sneeze looks like. In this video, I'm gonna talk to you about what a reverse sneeze is and what you need to do if it's happening to your dog right now. So since you guys are on my veterinary channel, I have to give you some veterinary terminology. And reverse sneezing has a term called paroxysmal respiration. Say that five times fast. So paroxysmal means a fit or an attack, and respiration we all know means the act of breathing. So a paroxysmal respiration is also known as a reverse sneeze. So a reverse sneeze is basically a fit of sneezing, but in a reverse way. With a reverse sneeze, you'll see the dog rapidly pulling air into the nose, whereas with a regular sneeze, the air is rapidly pushed out through their nose. During a reverse sneeze, the dog will make a vigorous snorting sound and they may seem to be gasping for air or even choking. The dog will extend his head and neck, his body will seem to freeze in a firm stance and he will rapidly inhale. It really does look like the dog is convulsing and something horrible is happening. So I forgot to introduce Duke here and he is being such a good boy. So some pet owners will run to their dogs, hold them, hug them until the episode of reverse sneezing is over. Other owners get very flustered, scared, and panic, get in their car and bring their dog to the vet. They probably run a couple red lights in a panic, and I don't blame them either. It's super scary when you see your dog convulsing and having a reverse sneeze episode. But don't freak out. Reverse sneezing should only last about one minute, and then the episode will be over and your dog will be perfectly fine. There are no harmful effects to your dog if your dog is reverse sneezing. Okay, so what the heck causes reverse sneezing in our dogs? The truth is, we don't entirely know why dogs do it, and all dogs can have a reverse sneeze attack. There's not one breed that experiences it more than the other. Breeds with short snouts such as Bulldogs, Pugs, Boxers, and Boston Terriers may convulse more during a reverse sneeze since it's harder for them to move air in the first place, which adds to the stress of these owners. But even these dogs will be completely fine before, during, and after the episode. It is thought that a reverse sneeze may be triggered when a dog inhales an irritant, such as dirt or pollen when your pup is sniffing the grass or dust bunnies inside the house when you forget to vacuum under the bed. Sometimes a reverse sneeze can be triggered when a dog goes from a warm house into an extremely cold winter air. Sometimes it can be triggered for no reason that can be identified, or even when they're excited when you come home from work. So we know what reverse sneezing is, but what if it's not that? What if it's something else? So how do we properly diagnose reverse sneezing? While most cases of reverse sneezing is completely harmless, there are some cases where it can be something that's more serious such as an upper respiratory infection, a collapsing trachea, a foreign body or something stuck in the throat or the nose. It could be cancer in the nose or throat or a polyp that could be in the back of the throat. So there are a lot of different things that can cause the reverse sneezing and it's always a good thing to bring your dog to the vet to have them assessed if this has happened for the first time. So if your dog is perfectly healthy on their physical exam, then your vet is safe to say it was a reverse sneeze. So your dog is reverse sneezing way more than you would like. You've been to the vet several times and they keep saying that the reverse sneezing is nothing. However, you really wanna stop this, so your veterinarian may assess your dog further and prescribe them antihistamines, allergy medications, and even antibiotics because it may be due to a slight upper respiratory infection. So what should you do while your dog is reverse sneezing? The first thing is to remain calm because any sort of excitement may prolong the episode. You can gently just pet them and tell them it's gonna be okay. Some people like to rub their throat and they think that that shortens the episode, but basically it will be over within less than a minute. All right guys, if you liked watching this video, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and I hope to see you back here for some more veterinary videos.